Okay, so this problem, we're starting out with 80 pounds of uh, contaminant in a large tank, and our cleaning process removes 13% of the remaining contaminant each hour, okay? How much contaminant is removed during the first six hours, okay? So, no, or to state in Norway, how much contaminant is removed after the first six hours of cleaning, okay? So I'm just going to walk through this again with a little table, and if, if you're you know if you if you're just real close and and you, you feel like you got the answer, feel free to skip the video ahead and check the answer. That's fine. But anyone that needs an explanation, I'm just going to walk through it again. So little table, hours, pounds, right? Hours, pounds. Okay. We start. That's zero hours with 80 pounds of contaminant in a big tank of 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 uh, dirty water or whatever it is it could be this could be an application for for many different many types of applications fit this model right um, so we're removing 13 percent of the contaminant each hour so after one hour we could if we wanted to get 13 percent of 80 so get that that's that's you know 0 0.13 times 80 which is um, 0.13 times 80, 10.4. Okay, and then we can subtract that. So we can go 80, subtract 10.4, and that would give 69.6. .6. So after one hour, we have 69.6 .6 pounds left. But the more, the cooler way of doing this is instead of getting 13% and then subtracting, we can do it all in one step by, can you remember? Thinking of what is 100% minus 13%? What does that give? 100% minus 13%? It gives 87%. And that's a really handy thing to use because it's a lot cooler to go 80 times 87%. 0.87 right and that will give the 69.6 .6. and this is going to be a lot handy more useful for us um, le uh, as we go along so anyway so we can go 80 times 0 0.87 and that gives 69.6 .6. so that does it in one step there's no subtraction there right and after two hours we would have 80 we start with 80 pounds we times it by 87% to get what's left in there after one hour. And then to get what's left in there after two hours, just times it by 0.87 again. Right? And so that is simply 80 times 0 0.87 to the power of 2, if I write it out in calculator uh, form. Right? And that will give me what's left in there after two hours, and so on. And I could do, I'll just do that for fun. Okay, so uh, 80 times 0 0.87 to the power of 2. So we'd have about 60 pounds, 60.5 or so, 60.6 or so pounds left after two hours. But we're interested in six hours, okay? Because we want to know how much is removed during the first six hours. In other words, how much contaminant is removed after the first six hours of cleaning? So after six hours, how many pounds, and this is pounds remaining, okay? After six hours, how many pounds are remaining? So you start with 80 pounds, don't you? Press pause and do it if you, if you think you can. And then to get how much is left after one hour, you times by 0.87 after two hours times by 0.87 again after three hours times by 0.87 and after four hours times by 0.87 and after five hours times by 0.87 and after six hours times by 0.87 that's how much is remaining after six hours or in calculator uh, form it's 80 times 0.87 to the power of 6. Okay? And that's how much is remaining after 6 hours. 
So I'm just going to use my arrows on the calculator. I'm going up here, press enter. I'm going across. I'm going to change that to, to a 6. Press enter. And I get 34.69. Um, and this is what is remaining. So looks like about 34.69 pounds remaining after six hours. But the question is, how much is removed during the first six hours? Removed during the first six hours is a different question, isn't it? So what we need to do is, how do we get that? Well, we started with 80 pounds, and then we had this much amount remaining. So how much was removed from zero hours to six hours? Well, we go 80, subtract the 34. So I've typed in 80, and I've gone, I've just moved my arrow key up to here, and I'm going to press Enter. Now it's 80 minus that, and now I press Enter, and that's 45.3. 099, etc. So remove during the first six hours, I'm getting 45.3. And then it says round your answer to the nearest pound, so approximately 45 pounds. Okay? And there's our answer.